Mauritius had a line of their own single herbs and then combinations. So medicinal blends, so kidney bladder being one, liver and gallbladder, nerve tea, bronchial cough and bronchial teas. And when I took over the business in 1972, the business was 97 years old. From what I know in the books that I inherited from the MERS family, I think it's probably from the beginning of MERS days that they had these formulas. When the store was formed in 1875, we didn't have patent medicine. Up until then, but all the herbs, like all those jars downstairs we have, the doctor would write out a prescription of a little bit of this, a little bit of this, a little bit of this tincture, a little bit of this herbal extract, and the pharmacist will just put it together, shake it, put it in a little bottle, and give it so people would take it. This is the same idea. The herbs are put in, in, in a blend of different herbs. So this being a kidney bladder tea. So when I took over, early 70s, things were changing more chemical, more drugs, more drugs. And so this was a learning experience for me. When I came in and people would come in and say, Herr Metz, I want a kidney and bladder tea. I need to get that stuff out of me. Kidney bladder teas to flush the kidney and the bladder. The old Germans would say, you know, I caught a cold on my kidney. Seriously. Instead of just running to get a pill or prescribe an antibiotic, what it is is basically herbs, combination of herbs that are mild diuretics and mild antiseptic. So if you have a beginning of a, a symptom of urinary tract infection, the more you drink, the more it flushes it out. Germans have always been about proactive about prevention as opposed to cure. You know, this is one of our top sellers, kidney bladder.